needs a garden wee before we put him in the car. Go, you two. Come on, then. Let's get Waffle in the car so we can say our goodbyes. Nice knowing you, pup. Mm. I don't think he wants to leave us, Dad. Brooklyn Bells? Good morning, Mrs Hobbs. That puppy. 
Is it going now? <sighs> yes, Mrs. Hobbs, going back to its owners today. Oh, my George will be so relieved. Did you hear that, Georgie? No more rocking. Oh, come on, time. Yes, come on. Oh, I've got Ruffles hard. I want to see if it's cure. Ah, Gramps lent it to me. Thanks. <laughs> Where is Waffle? Doug? Waffle? Doug was holding on to Waffle very tightly. Look. I don't want you to go, Waffle. Doug, it's time for you to say goodbye to Waffle now. But me and Waffle both moved in here yesterday. And I want us to stay as family together. I know. But it'd be okay living here in Waffle. I promise. And how comes Evie gets to go to the vet and I don't? Because you need to unpack. You need to settle into your new home. Anyway, you can't go to the vet dressed as a wolf. Come on, let's get Waffle in the car. Good luck. Morning, vet. Oh, good morning, Mr. Me. You've brought Pickles in to see me. Yes, I have. Oh, look at that sweet puppy, Pickles. Oh, you pretty boy, then. Oh, thanks. <laughs> good boy. When I pass the scanner over Waffle's coat, it's going to give a little ping noise. And that'll say that it's found the microchip. And then we can look up your owner's detail system, give him a call. And then they can come and pick you up. So, are you? Good girl. Okay. So, usually it's around here. Sometimes the microchip can move. Excuse me, Waffle. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Well, usually it pings when it finds the microchip. I don't think Waffle has a microchip. His owners may not have put one in. That's unusual, because all responsible dog owners know that you must. I'll have to take him to the kennels and hope that his owners get in touch. But why can't Wolf stay at our house till his owners come forward? Oh. Would you like to come with us, Waffle? Home! <laughs> What did he just say? Did he just... Oh, we'd have to do a lot of work, but yes! <laughs> oh, just for a little while longer, though. Oops. Such a oh. dog you are! Pickles! For a little while longer while we wait for his owners to come and claim him. Remember that, Evie. Yeah, but it could take weeks, and that's ages. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's go get his bed ready. I need to play with my pet. Yes. Is that okay? So then he didn't have a microchip, so it was either go to the kennels or stay here with us. Okay. <laughs> I mean, if you're going to stay here for a little while, okay. But we're going to need some dog rules, okay, Waffle? My slipper is my slipper. <laughs> oh, oh, it's all wet like it's been chewed or something. Oh no, Waffle. Oh, yuck, is that wet with me? Oh, oh, what is this? A blind squirrel? Oh, dear me. Don't worry, Mrs. Holmes, it was only my slipper. No, I mean, oh, dear me. I thought the dog had gone, Jess. Oh, yeah, uh, change of plan, Mrs. Hobbs. Waffle will be staying with us, just for a little bit. <laughs> oh, only until we find his owners. You'll get to know much about it. But George and I can't live next door to a dog, Jess. You're a vet. You know, cats and dogs do not mix. <sighs> we need to find Waffle's owner, and quick. Agreed. I'll put some posts on social media and print some leaflets so Waffle's owners see him okay. and come to get him. Right, Waffle. Okay, smile, Waffle. This
this will go on the leaflet so your owners see you and come and find you. There we go. <laughs> Smile. <laughs> Smile. Oh, he spoke again. <laughs> Very good, Doug. That sounded like it was Waffle talking. But it wasn't me, Dad. It was Waffle. It was, Simon. I heard him talking at the vet. He can talk. He can talk. I think we all need a good night's sleep to calm our lively imaginations. All right, Waffle. Right, come on, you guys. Here we go. What? Selfie. So Waffle was here for a little bit longer. And that meant stair games, training, and a lot more doggy fun mischief to come.